Okay, so yesterday was tough. Uh, it's an early morning again. Um, it's just one of those things. You pick yourself up, you dust yourself off, and you keep going. One week left. Of one week left. There was a comment uh, <laughs> in yesterday's video by Emmanuel something, who at the end of it he said, don't worry, you'll finish this project one way or another. And I was thinking to myself, what are these other ways that I can, <laughs> that I can finish this project? Hmm. One way, get up early, work late, grind, crunch, finish. Another? Subcontract Santa's little helpers. They seem efficient. Alright, so I had to take a quick pause from working on the book to make a trailer, so I'll let that play in the background while I mention what I'm up to. So I actually don't know when this trailer is going to come out. Uh, Mrs. Jazz is in here helping with press and promotion preparation and stuff. Um, but yeah, like, we don't know if we're going to release it on the trailer on my channel or if it's going to have an exclusive TV thing or if it's going to go on a different channel or something like that. So it's a bit up in the air. Just trying to figure out where the trailer will feature, but um, yeah. That, that's not a huge issue because in the end, next week, the actual animation will be up on my channel. I've given up on being healthy in crunch week. <laughs> Junk food it is for lunch break. <laughs> So I've hit my goals for today, um, at least for the, the book art, uh, and now it's time to wrap up and get ready to do some painting. So uh, I'm on schedule, but my schedule is ridiculously stupid at the moment. To give you a bit of an idea, I got this day all done and well and good, but I have uh, three full days work of the book and other work to fit in in a space of two to three days. This is my brother Asher. I think Great. you saw him briefly, but the last time he was he was in here, I had to cut the video because my son's name was in the background. <laughs> so, anyways, say I don't know. Say a few things about yourself. What are three things that you think are most interesting about yourself? I'm into arcade machines. I work in as a data analyst, and I like the stuff in your family. Awesome. Like painting. He's helping me paint the back room here. We've got it all set up. So, just gonna knuckle away and get to work. We got coat one done, guys. How are we feeling? Good. Yeah. I'm already done. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm bit done. of an arm workout. Yeah. <laughs> we were talking it's about um, lyrics you remember wrong. From but it was a Bohemian Rhapsody. Mm -hmm. There's one that. Oh no 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 no! Eye of the Tiger. I always thought was Eye of the Tiger. It's the Queen of the Fight. It's, what the, is it? it's the queen of the fight! <laughs> what is it? Thrill of the fight. Ah, uh, that makes more sense. <laughs> um, Torn by Natalie Imbruglia. Uh, Imbruglia? What? I don't even know what it is. No, it's Imbruglia. Is that, is that, is that what I said? Imbruglia? Imbruglia. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> <laughs> you said <laughs> Imbruglia. What is that? Imbruglia. Imbruglia. The glow is silent. Oh. <laughs> so go and finish, finish your story. Finish your story. Finish your story. You're halfway there. So I thought. So I thought she said, "I'm a lettuce face." <laughs> I'm a lettuce face. <laughs> this is how I feel. Good to go. Ding. All done. Thanks so much for your help, guys. Bye. He's got it coming out. Alright, it's 8.40pm, I've had two cups of coffee, and I didn't think I would get to work tonight, which, to be honest, given my schedule, I, I need to, uh, because I thought painting would take much longer than it did. But uh, we finished at 7pm, I got to do dinner, bath and bed with uh, Mini Jazza, and I'm able now to, to hit the, the workload, and I'm really hoping I can get a lot done tonight, and I'm going to just crunch on it. I know I'm just like saying the same stuff day after day and you guys must be getting sick of it but this is currently as you can tell all consuming 
It's ridiculous. Anyways, uh, so, I mean, there's not much else to tell or show. Uh, I'm just going to be going forward and doing that, and I suppose I'll, I'll let you know how it went tomorrow if I'm in, in a state to do so. Uh, so we'll wrap up with the question of the day. Shockmouths says, I'm going to feel like a raging idiot if I've only realised this now after all this time, but is the cartoon lady behind Jazza on the painted wall Mrs. Jazza? Right or wrong, I feel pretty stupid right now. So this is my Jazza avatar, and yes, this is Mrs. Jazza. It's a bit hard to see her because she's sort of hidden behind the desk, and uh, the funny face she's making is uh, to Life Stealer, the Dota 2 character, sort of hidden <laughs> in the corner there. Uh, but yeah, I painted my wife in my mural, and, and this mural contains all of the things that have been a creative and life inspiration to me and my wife is absolutely one of the most inspirational people to me and judging by all of your comments on yesterday's vlog you all understand how amazing and understanding and patient and wonderful and supportive and brilliant she is so yeah i i also a lot of you are sort of wondering why she isn't in the vlogs considering she features in them so much uh she she honestly is quite camera shy and she, we try not to make a big thing of it because she doesn't want to draw too much attention to it and she likes to get involved in talk and stuff and that's not for lack of trying i invite mrs jazza and encourage her and sometimes try and sneak her on camera a bit but yeah it's not something that i want to force too much and i'm sure occasionally you'll you'll get glances of her. These last few weeks have been really tough and this week and, and the rest of next week are going to be pretty much the hardest workload periods of time I've ever had. So the fact that she is just holding me up and pushing me forward and encouraging me and supporting me is just amazing and, and you all are so incredible too and I really appreciate the kind words and support you've given me to encourage me and keep me going. So Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you tomorrow.